My name is Lucas Geer, I'm the service manager here at Walker Pest Management. All right, guys, as you may know, Lucas, our fearless leader, come on, Lucas, step out here. He's been with us for uh, five years now, and uh, he's done a fantastic job. We would all be lost without him, right? Um, so there's not a single person in this room who Lucas has not stepped up and helped out. Uh, tremendously along the way and he continues to do that every day so we're very very grateful for him so his five years um, I had to cheat a little I had to ask him to to just straight up tell me what he wanted because he, he he's a moving target as service manager I get to uh, pretty much do everything here um, luckily I don't have to do much of the office work but as far as training with technicians getting out with technicians uh, doing stops myself doing inspections seal 100s uh, some sales a lot of service calls um, getting to accounts when there are issues and helping technicians figure out problems and uh, problem solving and uh, taking care of vehicles making sure technicians have all the supplies they need uh, it's a constant ongoing job, but it's uh, it's a day-to-day -day challenge. It's different every day, and it's, uh, it's a lot of fun. It's a joy here at, at Walker Pest Management. Some of my favorite things about the job is, one, it's something different every day. Um, I'm not stuck to an office all the time. I get to go out in the field. I get to problem solve. Um, I get to help customers that are in need. Um, I get to help technicians. And, and, and hopefully in that helping technicians, I get to um, instill a love for the job in them as well and uh, let them see how much I love the job and uh, also training. Um, I like the everyday challenges that it's never never gets boring. I also like working for Caleb Walker. He's one of the best guys I've I've ever ever worked for. So that's a joy in itself. Just every day coming, every day coming to work. When I'm not at work, um, I enjoy going for long bicycle rides uh, up over mountains, Caesar's Head. Uh, I did uh, road to the top of Mount Mitchell. That was really fun the day before my birthday. Um, I like to cook. enjoy cooking, mostly for myself. Um, but um, I enjoy, I have two little dogs. <laughs> And this is a normal part of your job, right? This is a normal part of my job every day. Can't, uh, I had to take this, excuse me. Yeah. So you said you have a couple dogs. I do have a couple dogs, my two little pride and joys. I have Milo, who's been with me for 13 years, and then I have uh, a little chocolate mess called Leona. Uh, she was a rescue, came up from Charleston last year at the time of the hurricanes and was evacuated up here. And uh, I saw her on the, the website, the Humane Society, and had to, had to get her. She's a cute little mess, but uh, those are my two dogs. Yep. But your some of your hornets are nest builders. Some of your hornets are dweller. Uh, European hornets like to dwell in uh, cavities. All right, I'm gonna jump inside here. Oh wow, you can actually see where the nest is spilling out. All right. So you can actually see some of the paper from their comb. Go down in there. But what they're doing is get behind that box.
And this is not a simple one, so it will take a couple times. But we'll get it knocked out. Thanks, Lucas. Yes, sir.